I have a 2018 house, brand new. Got some really good finds for you today. Let's pull out the camera and go check them out. So the very first thing we do is actually turn on the hot water going throughout the entire property to make sure that we have hot water supply to every fixture. We actually did today, but this one was pretty unique because by the time I made it to the garage, it had a pretty nice surprise. So for my next find, it's actually in the attic space. The attic space is pushing over 100 degrees right now and it's only 80 degrees outside. So it's poorly ventilated. One of the reasons why it's poorly ventilated is we have two mechanical exhaust vents. One exhaust vent isn't wired properly so we have open-ended wires just dangling down in the attic space and it's inoperative. So that's gonna increase the temperature up here. Me personally, I don't agree with mechanical exhaust vents in Texas because with mechanical exhaust vents, they always break within a five year time period. Any house that's five years old and I see mechanical exhaust vents, the motor's normally burnt out because it's always running. I recommend for natural ventilation. Natural ventilation will keep your energy bills low and also guarantee the attic stays cool just by natural methods. So you want turbines, bridge vents, box vents, and just make sure you follow the manufacturer's specifications whenever you install these to get proper airflow. So those are some two really good finds uh, on a brand new house. Uh, I'm really glad my clients chose me on this one or chose a home inspector to find these things because uh, they could have had some water damage, decreased life on the roof, and also higher energy bills. So that's Chris with A Action. If you have any home inspection questions, please give us a call and please like and share the videos.